Hi guys, today I've created something that I hope you'll find really cool. I've written a program that'll find the cap of this red color marker here and using the X and Y position of this marker relative to the screen, I'm attempting to control the position of two servo motors. One servo motor will be controlled using the X position of this marker and the other will be controlled using the Y position of this marker. Right now, I only have one servo motor, so what I'll do is I'll run it with the Y position. So you'll see the servo moving depending on the Y position of this marker. And then I'll switch the port on the servo motor so that you'll see it working on the X position as well. Alright, so I'll go. To, let's go to the code and I'll show you how it works. Alright, so here's the code right here. It's written in processing, which is a port of Java. I'll go into the details a little bit later. For now, I'll just show you how the code works and um, show you how it positions, repositions the servo motor. So, let's start this. So, as you can see, um, you can see me. This is the camera feed which I'm hacking into. This is the color which we are tracking, the red color here. And um, as you can see, the minute I put my marker in, it's immediately starts tracking the position of this the position of the red cap of this marker the x and y values which will be sent to the um, Arduino Arduino Uno which I'm using to control the position of the servo motor it is shown right above the box so as you can see depending on the position of where the box is these values keep changing along the y axis and the x-axis alright so now let me show you this with the servo so let me just plug the servo in alright so hopefully you can see this here's the servo and um, and yeah so as I move my marker up and down up, down, hopefully you're getting an intuitive feeling of what the program does and here is the soul moving based on the position of the cap. Alright, and now I'll change the pin at which the servo is connected so that you can see how it works depending on the relative position of the um, of the pens on the x-axis of the marker on the x-axis sorry so Show you this a little bit clearer. Oops. And as you can see, there's no movement along the y axis because that's completely different from this x axis movement. All right, so hopefully, um. You, I've given you a good idea of how this program works and like um, you can see it in action and so now for some boilerplate so basically yeah alright so um, alright now for some boilerplate I have used I've used processing which is a port of Java to program this code and I've used the J Myron library for the color tracking of the red cap of the pen um, I use the Arduino Uno running the default servo, um, servo for Mata program which which means that it can be controlled using the processing software which I've written right here and um, then the servo is attached to pins 9 and 10 depending on the position of uh, depending on the X and Y axes which you're tracking um, pin 10 for the y axis and pin 9 for the x axis. I'm also using the cc.arduino library for processing which lets me connect to the Arduino and use its um, 
use the server for Mata program which it's running. Um, for for more details on the co for more details or a copy of the code, you can contact me at codingassassin at gmail .com. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and comment. Take care.